We have a very special mission here at Sugar Creek Charter School. Our mission is to eradicate generational poverty in the lives of our students. As a charter school, we are K through 12, so we take children from the time they're five and we keep them till they're 18 because our goal is for them to be successful in life and you're not really successful in life until you get to your first job. And we see that as a K-12 journey. Our staff are here because they buy into the mission. They want to be a part of making a difference in the lives of our students. I would say that it was in kindergarten when I initially knew I wanted to be a teacher. That was something that I always said when they asked you, what do you want to be when you grow up? I want to be a teacher. And I never wavered from that um, my entire life. I think I just always had a deep-rooted passion for, for teaching and um, kind of projecting knowledge on onto others. Um, in turn of kindergarten, I think it just chose me, <laughs> so to speak. Um, when I came to Sugar Creek, there was a position open for kindergarten. The facilitator at the time, she she was like, I, I really think you'd be good in kindergarten. And I said, I don't know about that. And five years later, here I am and I love it and I wouldn't trade it um, for the world. It's, I love kindergarten. It's, um, it's something amazing just watching um, students come in who, on, who have almost nothing, it's like a blank slate and then being able to grow them and kind of just pour that knowledge into them. And then, you know, at the end, I feel like kindergarten, you see the most growth because now you have students who maybe they didn't know their letters, but now they're reading, they're writing, they're adding, subtracting. So like, that's a magical process to me to be able to do that year after year. Specifically about teaching at Sugar Creek, I love that there's a lot of room for growth. They really, they look at the teachers and they, they see where you can best be used and they're always supporting teachers. And more specifically, as far as kindergarten, I would say that our team makes it special. We have an amazing group of teachers um, within kindergarten and together we collaborate on a daily basis and we're friends inside and outside of work, which I think is so important. And, I, and we're really here for the students. I oversee the curriculum for kindergarten and first grade. I love being the K-1 facilitator. Um, kindergarten is my baby. I taught kindergarten um, and I tell everyone here at Sugar Creek that my team is the heart of the school. My team knows my favorite saying, college begins with kindergarten because we set the foundation, we set it up. If they love school at kindergarten, they're gonna continue to go forward. And just knowing that they have those skills at five, their brain's like a sponge. They soak up everything that you're saying. And so I just love to give that to them. And they come back. I have students that come back and say, you know, I remember you as a kindergarten teacher. You know, I loved you. And so it really makes me proud that um, we're making a difference. And it starts in kindergarten. Because if you lose them at K, you know, first grade, they're gonna not like school. So it's very, very important that you have a strong, solid base starting off in kindergarten. Uh, we do a lot of hands-on activities, um, a lot of parent participation. Um, this year with uh, being virtual, we face so many challenges, but we incorporated so many things to make it still seem like we're a family, we're connected. Um, now we have to get into what the kids are doing. There's so many different YouTube challenges and TikToks and things that we're doing. So my team and myself, we made several videos for the kids. We sent it out, we challenged them, we put it out on Facebook. And so the parents really love that connection and we did like different things to just grasp them and bring them in. Um, so I just love that. Um, I actually was adopted by my fourth grade teacher. Um, in fourth grade she took me in. I went to live with her in fifth grade um, and she just poured so much into me and she saw that I was one of those struggling students and so I came to Sugar Creek because I wanted to help students that I identified with. They look like me, they come from the same background, some of them as, as I do, and I wanted to help those students and pour into them because she poured into me and she was so great. I learned so much from her. I want to be able to give that back to other students. I am really excited to get the kids back in the building. We did come back for a short period of time, but not, not everyone came back. But next year, this year coming up, um, everyone will be on the building. I can just have more free range to actually make those connections in person. I can actually touch a kid or give them a high five or give them a hug if they're feeling down or having a bad day. And I couldn't do that this year. Um, so we had to make for up for those things. So I'm just super excited to get them in the building, um, in person, see their bright, shining faces. Even if I'm having a bad day, there's gonna be a kid that comes up to me and say, hi, Mrs. Marsh, I'm so happy to see you, or just to give me a hug and greet me. So I am just so excited to see their warm, bright faces. We are accepting applications at this point, particularly for children in kindergarten through second grade. 
on the website. The application is there. You can fill it out on the, on the website. It comes directly to us, and then our registrar will get in touch with you directly. There is no tuition to attend Sugar Creek. Sugar Creek is a public school. Consequently, there is no tuition. If you apply early, you can also have bus transportation and that also is free. We do breakfast and lunch um, and for at least the next school year, that is going to be free to all students whether or not they qualify for free or reduced lunch. So all of those things kind of make, the, make it a good time to come to Sugar Creek. I have seven students that I actually taught who have kindergartners that, I, that I've seen come through um, within like the last two years and I'm like, Wow, it makes me feel old, but I am yet proud because they were a student here and they thought enough of us to bring their students back to us. So it says that we're doing something right here at Sugar Creek, so I love it here.